Hi, in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to embed a Google Slides presentation onto a Moodle page as part of a lesson. So first thing that we need to do is we need to get our uh, to get our, our Google Slides presentation done and ready to go. Uh, once that has been completed, then we go up here, we go into File, and we want to publish this to the web. Now, our next option, we can put in a link, and then it'll put the put that slideshow into a full uh, onto a full page. But if we want to embed it directly, we just go over here where it says embed and click on that link. And then we want to choose the size as well as how often our slides advance. Uh, I usually just keep this one as the default. Uh, it doesn't really matter much because they don't typically. Uh, it doesn't auto play when you turn it on anyways. So uh, we want to click on this to select the slide size. Generally speaking, uh, with Moodle's new adaptive um, uh, interface with, uh, with Boost, uh, you want to keep them a little bit smaller than the medium size would say. Uh, so I would typically choose small. However, uh, depending on your particular use case, uh, you might go with medium or a set of custom size. Uh, for now, I'm going to pick the small version. And then I want to click on this blue publish button. It's going to ask me for confirmation. And of course, I want to say OK. And now I've got some HTML code to, uh, to put into my Moodle site. So I want to do a Control C. I'm on Windows to copy. And then I'm going to go over here into my Google course, or into my Moodle course. I'm going to click on my gear over here in the right-hand side. I need to turn editing on. My next step then is going to be to add an activity or a resource, scroll down into the resources section, and I want to add a label. I'm going to click on the add button. Change from, uh, I need to show some advanced buttons in order to be able to edit the HTML. So I want to click on this little arrow right here, go all the way over here to the right hand side where it says HTML, click on that button so that now I'm in HTML editing mode. And then on my keyboard, I want to do a control V to paste my to paste that code that I copied. And then if I click on the HTML button again, my uh, I can see that the embed worked. Go down here to the bottom then, click on save and return to course. And now my slideshow is embedded in my uh, Moodle site as a label. Now you can do this in multiple ways. If you wanted to embed this as part of a page, for example, I can go to add an activity or a resource. I can scroll down and add a page. And I just need to go into that HTML editing mode once again. So if I just go in my page, in my page content, pull up my HTML, paste this in here, Google Slides Embed. And then I go back to save and return to the course. You'll see I have a page resource right here. You can click on this, and you see that it's embedded in there. So you have multiple ways of embedding those Google Slides uh, into your course if you would like to do that. Uh, the key thing is to get the editor to come up, and you want to expand. You want to expand the. Uh, the options for your editor by clicking on this little arrow here, change to HTML mode, and then paste your HTML into there. Now this will work with any kind of HTML that you can generate with any kind of online service. So if you have a Prezi or if you have uh, some, other, some other online resource that you want to use to create content, uh, you can get that embed code, paste that into Moodle, and it'll be supported.